The daily weighing and measuring of tiny arms comes to the same conclusion every time. When the tape shows red, it means severely malnourished. Driving deeper into the mountains, we learned of a family struggling to keep their newest born alive. Here in their isolated community, they were living only on rice and prayers. Hamoud Abdullah is stunted and unresponsive. He has been malnourished his entire short life. Incredibly, he is two years old, but looks like he is just a few months. His mother, Amani, took him to the hospital once before. You could not imagine. When we brought him to the hospital, he was almost dead, and we thought he wouldn't survive. In the hospital, they said he was finished. They gave him oxygen and injections. We stayed for almost a month before returning home. Now he is sick again, and there is no more money left for the journey back to the hospital. Yemen's mothers are surviving on one meal a day, often just bread and tea. They are not getting enough nutrition to be able to breastfeed, and their babies weaken and die. The cost of a simple bus fare has spiked as fuel prices increased due to the war. Half of the country's health facilities are shut, and even if families do make it to one, they then have to pay for a place to stay in the town while the child gets treatment.